bricks, we bricks, we bricks, relax, we bricks, we bricks, relax, have a wax, relax, will you? Hello, FOX. Now, first things first, we didn't do our uh, advent calendar yesterday, so uh, let's get that done, shall we? Um, right, so we need to do six. Go. Oops. Okay, and six. I slightly wish the advent calendars from Lego were all minifigs. I would absolutely love that. I wish they'd put out a, a minifig only uh, advent calendar. I'd be buying that quicker than you could say minifig advent calendar. Now then, what's going on here? Hmm. Well... Who's going to guess what this is? That goes that way round. Oh no, wait. I've got red on top of this. Hmm. I'm not sure what this is. Goes that way. Well, it's another building, I think, but I'm one this is do you anyone right, hang on now what happens here it's on the way hmm. where's this bit go then how oh it goes on there sorry sorry thank you thank you for coming to my very minor panic, it's now over and it's concluded. Even though it's not strictly speaking a panic. Well, got no idea what this what this is. Absolutely none. Is it? Do we think it might be a a garage? A garage? A garage? You say garage or garage? Anyway, there we go. It's some sort of random mini building uh, again I don't know what it is right it's number seven now this is exciting isn't it that we get to do two in a day where is it why can't I see number seven? Oh, it's over here what have we got oh mm, okay together like that. That's on there. Then that there. Mm, it's quite hard to see what's going on here. going on there, then that there. Propellers. I mean obviously we're making a helicopter, that goes without saying. Boo. Um now how does this fix on? I think that goes there like that. Yep. Oh, I see. Oh, that's rather good. Oh, that's excellent. That's very good, isn't it? Very good. Okay. And you get some extra bits as well. Right, super. All right. Uh, so we shall carry on now with... Um, 
number two. Let's get this out of the way. And we shall <coughs> get straight down to the Google eyes. Off we go to it, shall we? Oh, by the way, I fixed that. Thank you. I fixed it. 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 Oh, that's yesterday's. Um, that's annoying. Right, we did that one. Here we go. Right, here we go. Jordan, Jordan, Jordan. Jordan. He says, I don't dream often, but when I do, uh, they tend to stick around. Uh, that being said, I had a dream once. I visited yourself, Mother Goose and Georgie Gibbon, and there were lots of Lego and laughs. Yeah, well, that's exactly what would happen uh, if you came to visit the Lego shed. I mean, that goes without saying. One day, we'll have an open day at the Lego shed. One day, one day when life gets back to normal. That will probably happen. And there will be cake and possibly a barbecue. And much fun will be had. Uh, oh, yes, over there. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Sharon Renzulli, Sharon Renzulli, Sharon Renzulli, Sharon Renzulli, Sharon Renzulli, Sharon Renzulli. She says, Yo, yeah, I have lyrics of a little town of Bethlehem for our carols. Oh, wait, well, you can't have a carol concert without a little town of Bethlehem. I mean, that goes without saying. Oh, little town of Bethlehem, how did we see the light? Thank you. I mean, I'm amazed that, that the call has never come uh, to me to sing on the stage of the Royal Albert Hall at Christmas. It, it, it really does. It, 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 I, I, I genuinely think the nation has been denied. Um, but there it is. There it is. Can you imagine if I get, I would be like Florence, what's her name? Florence uh, something Jenkins. I would be like that. There, there's, there's a long history, actually, of people uh, who genuinely believed they were amazing at singing when they were the ex exact opposite. So I, I don't think I would be doing anything out of turn, historically speaking. Uh, there, there, were, there were millionairesses who, um, who used to, to hire grand uh grand places and so that they could uh have a, give a concert and that they would be absolutely useless um there was a, a great uh, person in history who whoever who history has forgotten and, and it 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 it, uh, it is of great sadness to me and one day i'm i'm determined i'm going to i must write the um a, a script about her I really must but she's called Georgina Weldon and she was exactly that she was like somebody who genuinely thought she was had a great 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 talent and went to great lengths to promote herself she was sort of like the first person who was famous for being famous everyone's forgotten about her sadly she's amazing and the reason the reason we've got a uh, uh, the Court of Appeal is because of her. I mean, I mean no one remembers her. Sad. Um, Jordan, I'll do two days worth of red squirrel facts for you, Mother Goose. Let me get my researching spectacles on. Oh no, here she comes. Here she comes. <laughs> so, uh, I mean, hello. Uh, yes, hello, um, uh, Dame Dolly Neptune. Uh, did I, um, here, uh, the Muppets casually visit the notion of uh, cream first. Well, um, yes, uh, you did. And I'll tell you for why, uh, Dame uh, Dolly uh, Neptune, is because I, I genuinely can't remember if, if, I, if I go cream or jam. I, well, 
Yeah, I, I, yes, I, yes, I, 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 I'm sensing uh, your wrath is about to come before, uh, uh, before me, but um, I was thinking about it quite long and hard, and um, it's jam first. Yeah, all right, crikey, blinking heck, flimmin' heck, that was terrifying. Gee whiz, Eric, he's got a duck or fast you. They both like watching Lego, and they really like musicals. So his name is Eric. Ba ba ba, etc. Um, he says, uh, "I'm all alone with Tim Guff on the Pagoda." <laughs> Swoon. Well, you're not because Sarah Brooke is also there, and also uh, I've just noticed, Eric, you're, you're slightly on the wonk over there. I need to straighten you up. Mind you, I think the Tweedle Twins have made a request to return to the Pugoda today, so I shall sort you out when uh, when I get to them. Uh, this will also be done uh, for you. Uh, Sharon Red Solis says, Most firehouses are red brick. A stand-out building. A uh, stand-out building. Oh, okay, well, thank you for that, yeah. Uh, she also asks, uh, Jim Bob points, uh, where he beat? I got a crush on Brinzy, trembling up here on the cloud. Yeah, uh, ten four. Um, oh well, he's 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 up there, but just behind. Look, he's 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 there, just behind Bev Bratton. Hang on, ooh, he's uh he's here, he's here, Sharon Ranzuli. He's there, just uh, in front of Sue Perkins, next to Annie Miller, Bev Bratton. Ooh, jumpery, Danny Sigourney. Uh, Faye, Katie Hall, yeah, yeah, they're all good. Georgie Gibbon, they're all up there. Um, oh, let's give you a tremble, shall we? Oh, will you look at the tremble on that? Will, will you? Will you look at it? Will you look at it? Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Ooh, ooh. Um. Jordan says, love the MOC, Mother Goose, it's so cute. Uh, yes, I enjoyed doing it, actually. Look, it, it's, look, it's over here. Look, looks well, it looks good, doesn't it? Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that. Thank you for that. I enjoyed doing that. I, it's, I have virtually no time at all at the moment. And I suddenly had a, a moment where I, was think, uh, where I thought to myself, do you know, I haven't just done a little bit of Lego um for pleasure for just me in i can't remember when and um and so i i set myself a little hour aside and just went come on go and do it it's nice and relaxing and you'll love it and i did and i did love it i loved it loads i absolutely loved it loads oh hang on need that but yeah, I, I, I wish I had more time to do MOCs because I really enjoy doing them. I've got so many things I'd love to MOC as well. I would really, really love to um, put something in for Lego Ideas, but finding the time, gee whiz, forget about it. Forget about it. I mean, look how long you've all been waiting for your elb sacks, for goodness, mate, for, for goodness gracious. I'm absolutely determined I'm going to get those out before Christmas. I've just got to find the time. I know I keep saying this. Sorry, 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 sorry. Um, we thought she was from Canada and then we didn't think she was from Canada and then it turned out she was from Canada. Is Joe Ilyam B? Thank you. Thank you. She says, Thank you, Emma, for live and rigging last night. Excellent fun as usual. Your MOC is delightfully snowy. Happy birthday, Rosie Lee. Hi, Michael and Emma. Uh, welcome to the bleachers. Yeah, I mean, you're having a wild old time over there. There's no doubt about it. Uh, quite right, too. That's what I like to see, everyone having a good old time. 
enjoying themselves, kicking up their heels, possibly dancing. Possibly dancing. Do do do. Do 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 Can't decide whether when I'm breaking up for Christmas uh work wise I'm I'm actually trying to write a book at the moment. FYI. And then in January I've got I've I've got to write another book. Um so I'm slightly under the cosh with that. But it's always tricky because when you're self-employed, if any of you are self-employed, it's sort of just working out when you have a holiday. Because I actually I haven't had a holiday for the entirety of this year. It's it's mad, isn't it? It's bonkers. But it's been such an odd, horrible year anyway. But um, I can't. I'm just dying to go on a holiday. Yes, there's that. And, uh, but yes, yeah, so the problem is when when you are self-employed, is that you don't really know when 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 your time off is. It's a it's a it's a difficult one to balance. Ooh, look, we're making an arch. Things are suddenly coming in to focus. Have I done everything? Yes, I think I have. Thank you. Move on. Thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. Um. Tweedle, Mandy, Tweedle, Vos, Poo, Sue. They are twins and they love poo. Uh, Tweedle, Vos, Poo, Sue. Vapu, Sue. Says, hello, Mother Goose. Hello, 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 Vapu, Sue. Uh, love your MOC of the toy shop. Really cute and wintry. Uh, could Tweedle, Mandy and me please wear Father Christmas hats if you have enough? On top of our hair, please. We're happy to wear them uh, with pride back in the poo goda. Thank you. Uh, yes, now I have. Uh, I did. I did notice this message coming into my uh, inbox. So I have taken the. Uh, I've taken the step of of getting these things uh, ready and arranged. Uh, Twiddle Mandy, uh, Twiddle Vaspisu, and uh, here are your hats. So without further ado, uh, big hand, little hand. Let's uh, just. Uh, uh, get this on. Come on, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, this is good. Oh, this is good. I think to the side, like, oh, will you look at that? Uh, are you pleased with that? Oh, yes, I'm very pleased with that. Yes. Uh, can I see uh, uh, Vas Pisu in hers, please? Yes, of course. Yes, of course. Maybe I'll put yours on this side. So they sort of match. Oh, look. Really? Oh, oh. Uh, this is excellent. Yes, it is. I, I really like it. <laughs> look at you. <laughs> uh, look at you. Uh, shall we quest forth? Shall we quest forth back to the pagoda? Uh, yeah, let's let's quest forth. Yeah, let's let's quest forth. Come on, let's quest forth in our heads. <laughs> They're questing forth. They're questing forth. They're questing forth. Uh, back to the pagoda. They're questing forth. Back to the poo gouda in the heads. Questing forth. Oh, look at that. That's tremendous. Uh, Eric, look, come on. You're on the wonk. Oh, Lord, are you drunk? Oh, no, please don't let me have to get out. To oh, no. Don't look. Don't look. I'm I'm afraid I'm having to extract uh, Eric uh, with Felicia. <laughs> Thank you, Felicia. Thank you. Um... Right, let's just try and get you in there. Let's just sort your feet out. That might be the problem. It's quite tricky. <sighs> there we go. You're in. You're in and you're up. Fewey. <sighs> Fewey. Uh, let's just give you your close-up, please. Oh, look. I mean, will you look at them? So we'll get round Tim Goff. Marvellous, thank you. Out we come. Um, right, where are we up to? Um, Eric, so when I finally make it to the UK, I will have to decide which is better, cream first or jam first. Oh no, this, this, is, this is going to cause a schism. 
this is going to cause nothing but trouble. Uh, Bev Bratton says, Eric, just to be clear, there is jam first and there is wrong. You're welcome. Yeah, you, it, it's, it, it's, not, it's not worth it, uh, Eric. You, you need to leave this, this well alone. It is a centuries old um, debate. Well, it's not really a debate. It's more sort of, I mean, lesser things have started wars. Let's say that, shall we? Just leave it, leave it, leave it, leave, leave it. Leave the whole scone thing, just leave it. This. This. It goes in. Ooh. What's the... Oh, I see. That's going there. I think we're about to be off to the Twitter eyes. Oh, no, not quite. Uh, Sharon Ranzula, yo. Uh, squirrels, cute flying rodents, yo. In the south, uh, squirrels, a tasty meal. Here in New York, in my Ballywick, uh, we have black squirrels. Oh, we used to have black squirrels where I lived in Hitchin. Not a lot of them, but astonishing to see. And actually, I have seen a black squirrel in Brooklyn. Uh, yeah, they're a combination of the eastern grey and the fox squirrel. The law says squirrels come into their lives as a message to have more fun and take life less seriously. The squirrel is a symbol for fun and prudent planning. Yeah. Ten four. Uh, Eric says, oh, we have black squirrels here in northeast Ohio, too. It started when a Canadian professor came down to teach at Kent State and missed black squirrels from his hometown. He actually went back to Canada and, brought, and caught a couple of them and brought them here. They have since spread from Kent State to all over northeast Ohio. So interesting. Uh, the gang is over the moon about the red squirrels. Here a bit of a pest and sometimes rabbit. Meh. Hmm, interesting. Uh, right, we're off to the Twitter rise. Uh, Twitter rise to do be do be do Twitter rise to do be do be do Twitter rise to do be do be do 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 do. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Adjudication. I was slightly worried then that it was me. But I don't think it is. Adjudication. Adjudication. You can put evil Prof Lego in the Blair hole for conducting fraudulent polls. But who is evil Prof Lego? Well, we think it's John Perry. However, John Perry must retain his freedom, as there is no reason why I should adjudicate on people using multiple Twitter accounts. Um, John Perry. Oh, make sure you put evil Professor Lego's name in the book of Kennedy's, Emma. I don't understand this adjudication um, because, well, we seem to have had, we seem to have had a, a confession that, uh, let's get out the pen of punishment, that uh, John Perry is, uh, was the evil Professor Lego, um, 7th of the 12th, uh, 20, 20, uh, evil uh, prof uh, Lego. The time is, is quite late today. Good grief, it's 11.35. I was doing some writing this morning. That'll explain that. Um, and it's for the crime of uh, fraudulent polls. Uh, don't worry, little Sue. I'm getting out the ruler. Oh, yes. Thank goodness. Because... I was, I was about to remind you of this because, because uh, it, it's, it's much nicer when it's neater, isn't it, Emma? Yes, it's much nicer when it's neater. Oh, this is very pleasing. This is very good. Um, but the thing is here, uh, Mr Triggs, is how can I put evil, evil Professor Lego in the Blair Hole uh, but keep Mr John Perry out of the Blair hole. Um, sorry, I, I, I'm sorry, I'm going to ask for a clarification, please. A clarification, please, uh, Mr. Graham Triggs, a clarification on your adjudication, thank you. Uh, John Perry, uh, a great MOC. I'm currently building diagonally and I have brown blindness. It's almost impossible to see some of the instructions, uh, Katie Hall says. 
Uh, it, yes, it sucks getting old, doesn't it? Mm. Yes, it sort of does. Yes. Uh, Mr. Grove Triggs, who has been mucking around with my helmet? It's not on straight. Oh, so sorry, sir. Sorry, sorry, come here, sorry. Sorry. So, so, sorry, sorry, it's on straight now. Thank you, it's on, it's on straight now. It's on straight now, look. It's on, it's on straight now. You've, you haven't commented about your golden epaulets, Mr. Triggs. Don't think I haven't noticed. Honestly. Oh, no, I'm lost. Where am I supposed to be? I'm looking at the wrong page. Thank you. <sighs> looking at the wrong page. This is what ha this is what happens. It's just it's dangerous. Yes. And yes. Right. Is that page done now? Yes, it is. Thank you. Thank you. Well done, Emma. Sorry. Who is that? Who is that? Do, do you know? <laughs> No, I, I don't know either. I can't see them either, dog. Sorry, have you actually got a real dolphin in there? Yes. Who is, sorry, who is that again? There is a real dolphin in here. Well, can, well why don't you pan round and show us? No, he's, he's camera shy. Mm. <laughs> la, 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 la. Um, uh, twit twoo, uh, Owl and Harwood says, from what I'm reading... Uh, Jackie Swan would be a prime suspect. Uh, this is uh, obviously for uh, mucking around with Mr. Graham Triggs's helmet. Oh no, I see what's happened here. I'm so I'm so innocent. I'm 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 genuine. I mean, I, I don't know how you derive joy uh, from from tricking me in this way. Uh, I'm I'm just I, I'm I, I I'm just innocent. Okay, that that's all that's going on here. Innocent as the driven snow, la 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 la, la 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 la, and also gullible. It's a sort of a really dangerous co cocktail. Um, oh, I wish I could get that in. Maybe don't talk about that after talking about helmets. Oh, boy yourself, boy yourself. Um, Eric, most but not all firehouses in America are made with red bricks. Here is Chagrin Falls Fire Department. Department. At Christmas time, they put a leg lamp from A Christmas Story in the window on the right. I love it. Mm. There you go. Thank you. Uh, scrub down, scrub down. Uh, it's Jackie Swan. Uh, she says, my choir has met on Zoom since March. There is a time lag which makes singing together problematic. The only way Zoom singing works is if the leader sings, mutes all, and everyone else sings along to themselves. Otherwise, the noise is frankly unbearable. Uh, no, sounds like a perfect match for R RWB. Well, I suppose if we did do that, um, you could all make requests as to who you would like to hear singing, um, and then I can, I can facilitate those requests, of course. Uh, that's an option. And then you can all sing along. That's an option. Uh, but as ever, I leave these things entirely to you. Um, ooh, we're making some things now, so that's nice. Get into a bit of detailing. Uh, where's that? Where are they? Over here. Hmm. Gonna end. Oh, that's rather good, isn't it? That's going in there. Look. Oh, that's rather good. That's a nice little effective uh, fire extinguisher. We had we had a, f a very good fire extinguisher in the um, Ghostbusters fire house. You will recall. These ones are a little bigger, I fancy. They're the big ones, not the handheld ones. Um. The Bevis Masson, the Sensei, the Moaning Minnie, the Matter, the Lego Whisper. <laughs> oh, look, we've got a hat going on here. That's rather good, and I like it a lot. Uh, and we've got a clock going on here. Fabulous. Um, he says, Lovely, MOC. Then he says, Did you say you might be going away? 
to the peasants in law. No, Bevis, I didn't. I don't think I got, don't know that you're just trying to get me in trouble with Georgie Gobbon. The peasants, as if they're the poshest people I've ever, ever known. Um, Georgie's father used to be vintner to the Queen, for goodness sake. And her grandfather used to run the Royal Tournament. I mean, they're so posh, I don't even know what I'm doing being in part of their family. I don't know how I passed the test to get in, quite frankly. Um, then he says, my story absolutely did not need a dun-dun-dun-dun. Everything you do requires a... I beg to differ. Then he says that Lego Batman with Dolphin. It's from the second series of Lego Batman movie minifigs, which also included the equally brilliant Mermaid Batman. The first wave had the Batcave Man, Vacation Batman, and the oft-mentioned Fairy Batman. Oh, I, I mean, I couldn't want this more. <laughs> couldn't want it more. And the one in with the rubber duck. They're no longer available from Lego since they're several years old now. But you might be able to find them from toy shops and the like, as with all minifigs though, unless you have a friendly Lego whisperer to help find specific ones, it's pop luck what you get. Uh, Eric says, uh, Emma, have you replaced the batteries yet? Shh, be quiet. Shush, because I'll be in trouble with little Sue, and you know it. Just be quiet. Shh, stop snitching. Stop snitching on me. I haven't done it yet. Shh. Snitching. By the way, stand by your posts, um, gooses, because uh, I'm going to the post office today and I'm probably going to be in the post office for about three hours, I imagine. I shall say no more. But all gooses will be getting something in the post. Uh, those of you who are... Oh, and I'm going to make a request, actually, because obviously everyone in, in this country... We'll get it a lot quicker than everyone in uh, who's abroad. So could I ask you, please, to sort of keep it quiet so that the people who live abroad don't know what it is. They won't see it until they've opened it, OK? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We're making a delicious door here, and I'm really thrilled about it. So... No posting pics of what it is. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now then, what way up does that go? This way up. But they should start arriving. I mean, if if I make it first, if I, they were coming first post, so some of you might even get it tomorrow. Well, well now. Um, I'm loving these doors. Uh, Ruth Hay says, you asked about the upside-down door fiasco. Think it was either at the rear of the Parisian restaurant or the front of the bill that included the poo house. I'm ashamed to say I can't actually remember the title of the latter build, such is my dismay. At the shoving off the table, it was a terrible incident, yes. Uh, Red Rose Nosy, uh, Rosie says, lovely day relaxing with a few micro-build layers, 30 of 75 completed. Loving the dude up, brooks up right up. Orange and pearl gold coloured bricks against the snow white. Look at this. That's very good. Um, obviously, the Notre Dame still remains untouched. I haven't had. I haven't had a moment. I will get back to it. Um, bring, 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 bring. Um, hello. Relax with bricks. Yes, hello. It's it's Katie Hall. Oh, hello, Katie Hall. Um, um, heard from you and you haven't called in all you know uh, no i mean I, i'm very busy yeah that, i mean that's super um uh, uh, can i do anything uh for you well i'm just ready to 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 say that uh, excuse me did i miss the advent calendar or did you not do it <sighs> i'm sorry i'm sorry katie yeah i forgot, I forgot to do got to do it but you, you got double today so well i mean it's not really the same because it's an advent calendar so it's supposed to be on the day but you're not watching it sorry katie hmm. well anyway i absolutely loved your moc it doesn't look like a shark tank though just saying Shh, don't stop snitching i know i haven't done it i haven't got the bits i haven't got the bits cheap whiz flipping heck Snitching, snitch, snitch. Hang on, I've done something very wrong here. 
This is all wrong. This is entirely wrong. It couldn't be more wrong. Thank you. Now it's correct. Thank you. Thank you for coming to my very minor panic. Something's gone badly wrong. No, it hasn't. La, 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 la. Tra, la, la, la. Um, Ruth Hayes. Read Eric's uh, message on Red Brick Fire Stations. There are a number in the UK. No, I've mentioned this before. I lived in a council flat above Euston Fire Station, London, until I was five. Now G2 listed, a beloved former architectural historian commented upon Pick to Follow. Uh, a notable building built in 1902, arts and crafts style. Her parents had a two-bed flat on the third floor from their marriage in 1952 until 1965 when we moved. I was five. It's still very much a working fire station today. Oh, lovely. I know that fire station. How exciting you lived up there. Gosh. Uh, Neil says, beautiful building, Ruth. It reminded me of the old fire station in Hull, uh, which I've walked past many times, but searching out a photo is actually very different. Opened in 1932 and is known for the motto carved above the three arches, ready, I, ready. Converted to flats uh, last year. Oh, look at that. Ready, I, ready. That's a great phrase. Uh, Jackie Swan uh, says, uh, I uh, would like a fireman's helmet, please. I don't want to wear it. I just want a fireman's helmet. Oh, Jackie Swan. Right, okay. Well, thankfully you're on the front row, and uh, look, I can just, I can just put one right in front of you. There you go. Absolutely dirty, filthy mare. What a filthy, filthy mare she is. There we are. Look, I'll give you a close up. There, look, it's right, it's at your feet. It's at your feet. Thank you. Thank you. The things I have to do. On, I mean, really, serious, seriously? I mean, seriously. Even Bevis is shocked. Even Bevis is shocked. Now there's a lot of gifts. Uh, Red Rose Nosey says, uh, Mother Goose, cute little MOC. It's great seeing you gain in confidence and begin building your own sets. 10 out of 10 and a gold Christmas star. Thank you. Little Sue, uh, she's called Little Sue. She's little, and she's called Sue. It's Little Sue. Oh, hello there. It's it's me, Little Sue. I love the Sue. Oh, here we go. I am the owner of the cafe. Deserves the poisson, poisson. Deserves the poisson, poisson. But can you eat soisson? Croissant. Thank you, it's me, Bill Little Sue. Yeah, all right, yeah. Can, can I have a puzzle bottle for that song I just sang? <sighs> Ooh, I don't think, um, the, the red sound effect machine seems to be working today, am I? Uh, have you brought any medals in, perhaps? Um, anyway, what can I do for you today, uh, little Sue? Well, I just remembered this photo that I took of red squirrels on the Isle of Wight. Um, because uh, I was able to take it because I stayed as a BMP where the, where the owner is lucky enough to have them in their garden, please, please show the works the pictures of the red squirrels, thank you. There you go. It's super, it was really super, actually, yes. Um, perhaps you can now press, press the button. <laughs> so there you got away with that. By the way, can we just enjoy these, these doors? They're really super, sorry, fruity, but absolutely massive fruity, but, um, uh, Rosie, red rose, red rose nosy says, batteries, Emma. Batteries? I do believe the red sound machine is batteries. Shh, stop snatching. Uh, Ruth Hayes, a million thanks to Mother Goose for last night's L&B. Mayhem and thrills galore don't know how you do it. Uh, well, we'll do it because, because you lot will take part. That's how we do it. That's how that works. Um, 
It would be nothing without you, without you. It would be nothing. La 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 la. Uh, Neil says, loving your little Christmas toy shop MOC and that you've based it around the Winter Village toy shop shop toy shop set uh, looks brilliant from the signage i'm guessing you've also bought a pack of the lego extra stickers which brilliant Afflewax made us aware of uh, hashtag the team is the dream yes i have got a, a pack of stickers yep uh emma yes uh, i think i think doing a quick christmasy burrows uh, uh random house is a very good idea uh bev says oh yes a festive burrows would be lovely yes i i think i'm going to do that next and uh we shall just we shall just pretend we're making a festive a very festive house i think that would be good um <coughs> but i because i'd like to do it i really want to do it uh bev says <coughs> advent calendar <coughs> yeah i've done it i've done it i've done it i've done double neil says something that might help a little with the fitting of round plates and bricks into place is to remember that the studs will line up so if you line up the stubs with the surrounding ones, it might just help. Hashtag worth a try. Hashtag I have issues too. I just, I, I, it's like my brain stops working when I'm, I've got to put a round one on a round one. Uh, when does your brain ever work? Sorry, sorry. What? Did you, did you hear that, Dolphin? <laughs> I, I, there's someone in here being rude. It's, it's, I mean, do you know who it is? <laughs> It's like we're haunted. It's like we're haunted by by someone who's very sarcastic. Ooh, ooh, go on, go on, stare, get on, go on, you stare, get on, get on, you stare. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I find shouting at stairs really helps. Uh, with making them work. Uh, Red Nose Rosie says, thank you, lovely F works for all the birthday tweets and especially to Owlin for his totally amazing ode to Rosie. It was amazing, wasn't it? It was absolutely amazing. Um, Mike, uh, formerly Tobin Mori, Jake, he got the wrong email. A hashtag two-part of Affleck Advent Day 5 brings the arrival of a future love interest for Harry with another of Hogwarts students, Cho Chang. What will Day 6 bring? Mm, that's a good minifig. Uh, and then hashtag two uh, part Affle, uh, part, two parter Affleck advent. Uh, this is from Neil. Day six of Harry Potter calendar brings its representation of the Goblet of Fire, which in the stories was set up after the arrival of the Durmstrang and Beau Baton students. Hashtag what will be next? Hashtag remember to open the doors. Thank you. Uh, Jordan, Doctor Jordan's facts. Drum roll. Um, red squirrel fact number one. Well, here we go. The red squirrel of Eurasian red squirrel, uh, the red squirrel or Eurasian red squirrel is a species of tree squirrel common throughout Eurasia. The red squirrel is an arboreal, primarily herbivore, herbivorous rodent. In in Great Britain, Ireland, and in Italy, numbers of decreased. Decre I can't. I can't. What's the matter with me? I can't read. Am I having a stroke? Get on with it. Uh, in Italy, numbers have decreased drastically in recent years. This decline is associated with the introduction by humans of the eastern grey squirrel from North America. However, the population in Scotland is stabilising due to. Hang on, I can't see what it's due to. Uh, due to conservation efforts, awareness, and the increasing population of the pine martin, a European predator that selectively controls grey squirrels. Mm. The red squirrel, like most tree squirrels, has sharp curved claws to enable it to climb and descend broad tree trunks, thin branches and even house walls. Its strong hind legs enable it to leap gaps between trees. The red squirrel also has the ability to swim. What? What? The coat of the red squirrel varies in colour with time of year and location. There are several different coat colour morphs ranging from black to red. Red coats are most common in Great Britain. In other parts of Europe and Asia, different coat colours coexist within populations much like hair colour. 
in some human populations. The red squirrel sheds its coat twice a year, switching from a thinner summer coat to a thicker, darker winter coat with noticeably larger ear tufts, a prominent distinguishing feature of this species between August and November. A lighter, redder overall coat color, along with the ear tufts in adults and smaller size, distinguish the Eurasian red squirrel from the American Eastern grey squirrel. Red squirrels that survive their first winter have a life expectancy of three years. Individuals may reach seven years of age and ten in captivity. Survival is positively related to the availability of autumn winter tree seeds. On average, 75 to 85 percent of juveniles die during their first winter. Oh dear. And mortality is approximately 50 percent for winters following the first. Oh, that's sad. That's sad. But that does conclude. But well done, Jordan. And that does conclude. Club business. Oh, no. Um, I, I mean, seriously. Enough is enough. Yeah, I mean, I, I mean, I, I, I don't, I don't, I, I, I talked to you about this very seriously yesterday. Mm, yes, yes, you did, yes. And you still haven't j changed the batteries, have you? Um, uh, no, no, I haven't. Why? Oh, good God, what's happened? Oh, this is wrong. This is on wrong. Thank you. This is on wrong. Oh, no, Brian, Brian. Oh, crumbs. Ah! <coughs> oh, this is a big job for Brian. <coughs> Come on, Brian, you can do it. <coughs> Come on, I'll help you. <laughs> yeah, that was a bit bad. Sorry, 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 that was bad, Brian. Sorry, sorry, Brian. I hadn't realised that this... Hang on, I need to put the bigger one on first. Put the big one on first, it's here. Right, that's it. Okay, there's a little bit of an overhang, which we didn't factor in. Get down. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No, it wasn't a minor panic, thank you, but thank you for coming anyway, thank you. Thank you. Ooh, we're making something rather nice. I'm going to make two of them. So here goes. Yes, we need. Uh, I, I need official official uh, confirmation, please, as to what you'd like to see me do next. So we're either doing a, a Christmas version of the. We'll, we'll 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 do sort of a spruce up of the burrows. Um, or we can do something else. Remember, actually, I've got. Do you remember I've I've got that uh, that Chinese thing? That's the toy shop. That's not a knockoff. It's uh, we've got that to do. That might be that might be fun before in the run up to Christmas. So um, off we go with a pole, please, Prof Lego. We should offer up Perks's Batman thing as well. So let's have a run off between a Christmas version of the Burrows. Um, The, the Chinese toy shop and Perks's Batman clay face, which we could also Christmas up. We can Christmas up that as well. Hang on. Yes, that is correct. So over to you, my darling little wax. Voila. Rather good. Uh, 
lovely. Quite in. There it is. Okay. Voila. Hydrant. That's rather lovely. And that's going in between. Oh, I don't like it when they're in between. It gives me the heebies. Um, oh, this is fun. I won't tell you what it is yet. But it's fun. Can you tell? How does that go on there though? Oh, always. That's a tremendous hat, isn't it? Good top hat. That's going on there. That's fun. And that's it. That's the end of bag two. So we had some nice detailing today. In there, not much, but little. And I think I think today's triumph were these rather marvellous doors, uh, which I like very, 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 very much. Um, they're really nice. Anyway, so that's that. So that's that. Uh, come back tomorrow, and we will make a start on bag three, and we'll have a poll, please, Professor Lego, as to what we'll be building next. Thank you. Just in just in case we finish bag three tomorrow, just in case. I don't know if we will. But just in case. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Afro Forever. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.